Hey Lakers fans, before we jump into these potential game-changing trades, make sure you hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for all the Lakers updates you need. All right, let's talk trades. The Lakers are gearing up for the 2024-25 season, and after a lackluster offseason, they need some serious upgrades. With LeBron James getting closer to the end of his career and Anthony Davis battling injuries, it's crucial for LA to make some smart moves. Here are two trades that could give the Lakers the boost they desperately need. Trade 1. Lakers get Corey Kispert, Wizards get Jared Vanderbilt, and a 2025 second-round pick. The Lakers have been exploring trades involving Jared Vanderbilt, known for his defensive prowess and versatility. While Vanderbilt is a defensive asset, his offensive limitations, especially his inability to stretch the floor, have made him expendable. LA desperately needs a reliable shooter to open up the court for LeBron and AD. Enter Corey Kispert from the Washington Wizards. Kispert is a sharp shooter who averaged 13.4 points, 2.8 rebounds, and 2.0 assists last season, hitting a solid 38.3% from beyond the arc. Adding Kispert would dramatically improve the Lakers' spacing, making it easier for LeBron and AD to operate inside. The Wizards, fresh off trading Denny Avdija to the Portland Trail Blazers, might be open to moving Kispert as they focus on rebuilding. By acquiring Vanderbilt and a future second-round pick, the Wizards get a solid defender and an additional asset for their rebuild. It's a win-win situation. For the Lakers, bringing in Kispert alongside rookie shooter Dalton Necht greatly enhanced their perimeter shooting. This boost in offensive firepower and court spacing could be just what they need to bounce back from a rough offseason and reassert themselves as championship contenders. By 2. Lakers get player. Gets. Insert trade details. You can customize this trade based on any specific players or teams you want to include. So, what do you think? Lakers fans, would these trades make a big difference for the team? Or do you have other ideas to help the Lakers improve their roster? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I want to hear what you think. And don't forget to subscribe for more Lakers news and updates.